millions of people, particularly in developing countries, do not have access to basic consumption goods. Recently, the government of the Dominican Republic was grappling with the problem of how to deliver basic consumption goods to the poor sectors of its population, and this created an opportunity to study the effects of competition on prices and quality. First, on the demand side, the government provided monetary transfers to poor families in the form of debit cards that can be used in grocery stores affiliated with the program. Second, on the supply side, the government considered three strategies. One, sell these goods directly to the program beneficiaries. Two, outsource the sales of such goods to the private sector and regulate prices. Or three, outsource the sales of such goods to the private sector and promote competition. As previous academic work suggested, each strategy had pros and cons. Policymakers wanted to control prices, ensure consistent quality, and prevent participants from wielding disproportionate market power. The government decided to adopt the third strategy. To test its efficacy, two researchers, Matthias Busso and Sebastian Galliani, carried out a randomized control trial in 72 districts. In these markets, they randomly increased the number of retailers. They collected data on both retail stores and households before and six months after the intervention took place. Busso and Galliani found that entry into the market led to a statistically significant improvement in self-reported service quality and reductions in prices ranging from 2 to 6 percent. In fact, prices dropped more in areas where the number of entrants was larger. The benefits of social programs that subsidize consumers can potentially leak into the profits of the private providers that are serving them if the supply side does not operate in a competitive environment. The findings indicate that competition provides an effective means of avoiding rent capture by suppliers. This study also contributes to the public finance literature by presenting experimental evidence suggesting that governments that choose to outsource to the private sector the delivery of services can use competition to achieve lower prices without sacrificing quality.